go like go three again with the blend and then into our throw. Okay, that's, I'm, I'm telling you, that's it. There's just this little inconsistency and it's only because that the, the racket is a lighter load. So then your hand just gets accustomed to that timing. So now we'll do the same thing. You're gonna still line up as if you were thrown to this ball bag. Okay, so set your sights here. But now your throw, when you throw the ball, your execution of your throw is gonna be right here, okay? Don't cheat and don't take your alignment and shift it. Take everything like you were going here, but now we're hammering glove side because this is gonna naturally increase your hand's tempo into the slot, okay? Three reps. Good. Good. Line up here to me. That's her. Give me three in a row. Come on. It's okay. Good. One more. Leg lift, hands separated to me. Yes, sir. That a boy. One more. Dude, that's it. Leg lift, go ahead and keep your hands in. Regular leg lift. Good, so that's it, right? Though We need to start now teasing in that movement, okay? Because as soon as you went hands in, what happened, right? You disconnect, yeah, you disconnect, and same thing. Great job, get a drink, bring the racket. As soon as we get back here, your body, you're fighting against motor control patterns that you've had for so long. Yeah, dude, so it's like, like I said before we even started, you know, like it takes a lot. Right, and it's like I, like I said, it's super easy to get discouraged because I'm the same way. But just know, like, okay, we're not there yet. Yeah. Check the ego at the door. Maybe I need to do a little pause. Maybe I need to gather. Maybe I need to just hammer 314 reps from this. Right, like it's these little things, these little victories, that like mean all the difference in the world.